Hello and welcome back to another Python tutorial. My name's Tom with Master Code Online. As always, do not forget to share, like, and subscribe to our channel. In today's tutorial, we're going to keep working on our uh, object-oriented program for school, or school program, or whatever we're building here. Um, so in the previous tutorial, we looked at how we can grab the, in the initial data up here and uh, work with it. So what we did here was create a full name, last name, and we returned that using a method right cool uh, so how about how do we change the data that's up here that was initialized inside the init um, constructor uh, so let's go ahead and take a look at that we're gonna create a method that will change the person's age on their birthday so let's get in uh, define birthday and I'm gonna make this very simple right now and we're gonna come back in a, another tutorial and make it more dynamic okay so uh, let's do uh, self dot age and then we're gonna just do plus equals one and we're gonna return self dot age really simple alright so what we're gonna do is when we call this method it's actually gonna change the value of self dot age to um, one year older all right so let's go in here I'm gonna kill my interpreter and fire it right back up and we're going to go ahead and say uh, from student import student, just like that. I'm going to say A is equal to student. And I'm going to say Tom, comma, Myers. And I am uh, 14 and uh, I'm in ninth grade. All right. And we don't need the GPA since we said that is default. Whoa, my pen just went full on. All right, so um, so we got student, and then we want to go ahead and say, hey, it's the student's birthday. All right, so we just do a dot birthday, like that, and hit return, and it returns fifteen. All right, now just to show you that age actually changes with inside the object, we will say a dot age, and we get fifteen. See that how simple it is to work with classes and methods and change the object around. So don't overthink it. All right. So in the next tutorial, uh, we'll go ahead and make this a little bit more dynamic um, because, hey, uh, I don't want to have to call the student's birthday on their birthday. I don't have to, I don't want to go through and do that. So let's go ahead and make this more dynamic. I'll see you in the next tutorial. Uh, as always, don't forget to like, share and subscribe to our channel. Have a nice day.